Good morning, guys. Um, today, I thought I would take you, I'm just gonna go run some errands, actually. Probably just one errand. I find that with the three kids, it takes a little bit longer to get everywhere, so um, once we get in the car, I would like to get everything done, but inevitably it just doesn't work out. So we are gonna go down to the co-op and um, try and get most of our food for the day. Um, the co-op just opened a couple of months ago downtown, and so uh, it is definitely the place that I go first to shop. Um, I would love to go to the farmer's market. Unfortunately, they are typically open during Miss Lucy's nap. There she is, right there. Hi, Lucy. Hi. And then it is dinner time, and so I don't really have as much opportunity to get over to the farmer's market. However, the uh, co-op offers all of the same stuff because they get it from the local farmers. I'd probably just pay a little bit more, um, which is okay because I want the local organic fresh food and especially since I don't have my garden this year, um, it gives me another option. So I am going to take you along and I hope you enjoy it. So what's going on guys? We're going to the co-op, yep. You excited about the co-op? Yep. What's fun about it? Because I, I, I don't know. You don't know. Oh, Sugar Sprinkles is saying hi. Sugar Sprinkles? Can you see it? No. I don't know if you can see it. Oh, she's right there. <laughs> she's sing on mom. Yep. Hi, Camel. And that was ghosty. Just we got not. here to the co-op and we're gonna have a great day. Yeah, we just arrived. We just arrived? Yeah. Alright. We have like cars Let's here. Go. Oh, and do you smell that? It looks it smells like they're making garlic bread. <laughs> back from the co-op and we had a very successful trip. I got a bunch of food, lots of vegetables, a little bit of meat and eggs, not not too much. Well maybe a lot of eggs for some people, that's not a lot of eggs for us though. Um, we had a good trip, the kids were really well behaved, they like to drive around the little cart, although I wish they had more than one cart it would be a little bit easier for mama that instead of sharing the one cart. Um, we got a lot of lettuce. I got four bags of lettuce. I go through a lot of lettuce. Everybody in our house likes salads, so we try and eat those every day. I actually have a blog post about our meal size salads and how we add nuts and seeds and beans um, so that to make them very filling for us. So they, they really are 
a meal instead of just a side salad. Um, I also got some kale, which we use in green smoothies every day. My favorite uh, recipe is really just kale, um, a banana, a couple handfuls of frozen strawberries, a couple handfuls of frozen blueberries, and some water, and you blend it up, and it's delicious, and the kids love it. Sometimes I'll put in a little bit of yogurt, too, and then they think it's ice cream. I know, mean mama, but there it is. Um, we got onions. I love onions. I put onions in everything, but I especially love these spring onions. Well, even though it's the middle of summer now, um, they are delicious raw and in salads. Um, I got some broccoli and cauliflower. I like to um, cut it all off in a bowl and put a vinaigrette on it and then just let it sit. My kids eat it up and I will never complain about them eating cruciferous vegetables, so um, it's, it's really a delicious way to get in some, some vegetables and the vinaigrette kind of breaks it down a little bit so it's not as harsh. I know that some people have trouble eating raw broccoli, um, but we don't have that problem so we just eat as much as we can. There were some apples down there so they each got an apple. Um, they're not quite in season yet around here, and actually I'm not even sure how the season will go because there was a huge hailstorm um, back I think in June, the beginning of June, and it hurt a lot of the apple trees that are, that are around here, so um, we usually do pick your own in the middle of September to the end of September, and I'm not sure how that's going to go this year, so we will see about the apples. It'll be really sad though since I did not get out strawberry picking, so I'm relying on the apples for our um, jelly needs for the year. I usually make jams and jellies every year to last us, and so crossing my fingers for apple jelly, but we will see. Um, I got a red cabbage, which my kids call purple cabbage. Can't really see it with the black countertop, but... Um, they love it. Uh, they love coleslaw. I just make like a little sour cream, mayonnaise, garlic, and lemon dressing to put on it and they love that. And they also like it with um, like peanut butter and rice wine vinegar and a little bit of chili paste. Um, that's also delicious as well. We mix it sometimes with zucchini or um, like zoodles or also pasta. It's um, really good. And then I got some, um, this is just sausage. I like to put sausage in our pasta sauce and I also like to make um, like a knockoff of the Olive Garden Zappa Toscana soup. And so um, I got this, it's frozen so it'll go in the freezer but I'm sure we will have some cold days and I'll want to make a soup so it's nice to have that in the freezer available. And then eggs, we got two dozen eggs. We go through so many eggs. I think we got used to having our chickens, which we unfortunately lost. Well, we didn't lose them. We processed them last year, and we did not get new chicks in the spring because um, Lucy was still little. I mean, she's still little now, but um, I, I didn't want to have to deal with taking care of the chickens through the summer. Um, so we go through a lot of eggs and these are actually not much more expensive than eggs in the market um, because of the whole avian flu issue uh, in the Midwest um, but I prefer local organic free-range eggs anyways so that works out well for us I know that I'm, I'm not really paying a premium for them which is perfect for me so this is our little co-op haul this will give us vegetables through, well, probably through the weekend. I mean, we go through a lot of vegetables. Not a bad thing, kind of just an expensive thing. Thanks so much for coming to the co-op with us today. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did enjoy it, please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe for all of my future videos. Um, I hope to do more grocery slash co-op slash farmer's market hauls in the future because that's definitely a passion of mine, local food and um, food in general and eating food. Yes. So, <laughs> so look for more of that in the future. Thanks so much.